What's going on, everybody? I'm about to show you guys how to negotiate with sellers right now. Because right now, sellers are beating you up. That's what's happening. You should be beating sellers up, okay, guys? Because how do you negotiate in a seller's market? Well, guys, I'll let you know. That's what we're going to talk about. Let's go right in. Oh, here's AJ. What do we do on Thursday? Thursday is a batch call day. Dang right. Batch leads, baby. If you don't have batch leads, that's okay. Try it out for seven days for free. I swear you'll like it. Today, this is what we're going to go over. I'm getting a lot of messages, AJ, you know, from people on my network saying, hey, Nate, talking to the seller, they, they want to sell, but their price is too high. So I'm going to show you guys how to use batch leads to negotiate with sellers in a seller's market or a buyer's market. They're both different. Right now, we're moving towards more of a buyer's market just because you can't sell everything super quick. Someone wants to sell, price is too high, what do you do? batch leads and we're going to pull up the mind map okay so we're going to go to this part of the mind map it says make offers to sellers to get contracts we're going to go over to the sales process okay because we need to know how to talk to sellers there's an on-market sales process that's for making offer sellers that are on market now we're going to go to off market because we're going to assume most of you guys are trying to get sellers off market so we're going to look up uh, my boy tony tony green we're going to look up his property we're going to use bath that's all we do let's see okay 150k okay so this looks like it might be like some kind of townhome or something let's see so property's vacant. See, Batch has got everything. Got so much information, I got to type it in to search it. Okay, so what I would do, first of all, when I'm talking to the seller, this is the exact process I'm going to go through. I'm going to do it with you. AJ, you're going to role play with me. So I'm going to be going through this process pretty quickly because this is a role play. So AJ, you own this property. You are Devin. And I'm just going to ask you some questions, okay? And we're going to get to the part where you want a lot. Hey, hey, Devin, how you doing? Hey, good. Good, good. Hey, Devin, I'm calling because I was driving by your house the other day and I noticed that, you know, well, actually, I didn't notice it was for sale, but I was calling to see if it was for sale. Are you by chance selling the house? Might have thought of it once in a while. Well, hey, real quick, I just want to say, I know I called you out of the blue. Is right now a good time to talk or are you busy? It's okay. So, Devin, right now, my purpose of this call is just to chat with you a little bit and see if I can make you an offer on the house. I buy a lot of homes in this area. I want to see if this is something I could buy. And by the end of this call, I'd like to hopefully be able to move forward and make you an offer. Yeah, that's okay. So, Devin, first thing I kind of want to know, I know I called you and you said you've been thinking about selling. What's got you thinking about selling yeah my son passed away so oh, i'm sorry to hear that so you don't live in the house your son passed away so you're trying to sell it now is that right yeah well you know first of all i like to find out why you're selling i totally get it now but i kind of want to review with you some of the options just to make sure to see what you've explored so uh, mm -hmm. first of all have, have you thought about just listing it yeah i thought of doing that but um, my friend has been bugging me actually to have this listed yeah. uh it's been a while so I just don't think i don't have the time to do whatever she okay. wants me to do okay so listen thing is probably not something you want to do. So keeping it, renting it, even flipping it. I'm sure you don't have the time to flip it yourself. So it sounds like to me, after kind of going through some of the options on way to sell your house, you don't want to list it. You don't want to rent it out. You don't want to flip it. So it sounds like a cash offer is what you're looking for. Like someone that can just buy it right now in seven days and just be done. I think that would be an option. I'm assuming you have an idea of what you want for it. Um, I did see that. And I would have called that the online platform. Um, mm -hmm. Zillow. Or Zillow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I probably would want to go higher than what I see there. Mm, and why is that? You just want as much money as you can get? I think the property is in a pretty good condition. Okay. No, that makes sense. So let's pause real quick in this role play. Everybody, what I'm doing is I'm trying to find out if this is even a situation where a cash sale even makes sense for this seller. Now we understand, okay, this is somebody that we can work with. Then I get into negotiating later. I asked her what she wanted for the house. That's it. That's all I wanted to know. I'm not trying to say, well, this is my offer. I don't even talk about it yet. Because you can't talk about this stuff until you know what's going on. Because if you don't have a motivated seller, it ain't going nowhere. You can't convince someone to take 50% value of their home if they don't have a reason to sell to you. Like, let's go back into the role play. So tell me again, what do you want for the house again? Um, I was really hoping to get rid about 300. How did you come up with that again? Well, there were properties in the area, in the neighborhood who actually got it sold for 300. I'm actually looking at at it right now. So you said you were looking at properties that sold around that in that area for 300,000. Did you check to see if those were like comparable to the one that you that you have like same bedroom, same bath, townhome? Did you check that or did you just see stuff for sale? No, I just looked. Well, look, I'm looking at it right now and underneath townhomes on batch leads, the batch leads is a service I use, right? It, it helps me comp properties. You know, you're asking for 300,000, right? I'd love to get you that, but um, maybe they sold like 
like that over the last two years, but the market's really shifted. Yeah. Prices are going down. It's harder to sell stuff. Yeah, I've heard about it. You know, I understand that you want that, but you know, I feel terrible. I, I'm definitely not going to be able to get you close to there. So let me ask you about the condition of the house. Is it in awesome shape? Have you updated everything? Yeah, actually my son updated that. Okay, well, let me ask you this. You know, are there any issues with the property? I don't think there are. How soon do you need to sell this thing? Yeah, I just want to get rid of it. Maybe give me like 30 days to close? Yeah, I can do that. What would stop you from selling this? No, nothing really. I understand why you're selling, but you know, according to the comps that are in the area, properties that are extremely rehabbed and really nice, you know, they go upwards for, of like maybe like the 200, 250 range. And mm -hmm. yours, from what you're telling me, it's got a little bit of updates, but I'd still probably have to go in and, and get the whole place updated. I think according to the numbers here, I would probably have to be around, according to what I'm looking at, probably around $100,000. What's the best deal you could give me? I could probably go for 150. Okay. This is what we're going to do. I have to get my offers approved by my underwriter. So I'm going to go to my underwriter. I'm going to call him and I'm going to see if we can get 150 approved. If I can get this offer approved, are you ready to sign today? Yeah. I mean, if we could go for it. All right, guys. So then I use this time. I've looked at the data. I would actually comp this out a little bit more. I don't know much about this property. I just have the address. So here's our property. What I'm doing right now is the underwriting process. You said 150. I'm looking at this to see if it's possible. So I put everything into my calculator. So let's just say this house is worth 250 and you can get it at 75K. Here's all your expenses for flipping it. It's uh, 1,300 square feet. Yeah, no, this is a deal, 100%. You got a deal, brother. After we go to asking price and negotiate, you get contracts signed over the phone in person. You don't let them out of your sights. You don't send the contract and just say, hey, I hope you sign. Doesn't work. The community that's watching, hopefully that was helpful, guys. Let's just a quick recap. If you're trying to negotiate a great deal on a property, you have to go through the painless wholesaling mind map and check out the script that's here. Check out the sales process. It's going to let you know how to talk to a seller. You're not negotiating a great price unless you find out why they're selling. Once you find out they're selling, when you get to the price, the part about you know anchoring, finding out what their property's worth, use batch leads, run the comps, look at the properties. You can use Zillow too, just to verify. Call an agent in the area just to verify price like we just did. And for Tony that's watching this, if he hasn't, you know, if you haven't fallen asleep because, you, you know, maybe I've just talked too much, you have a deal at this price, it looks like, unless it's destroyed. If it's destroyed, it's going to be tough. But if it's a basic rehab, you look like you got you got a good spread that somebody will buy this. Now, I can help you find a buyer. If you go to sellyourdeal.io, uh, my website, you can submit deals um, and I can help you guys. Hopefully this was helpful to you guys. Guys, sign up for batch if you want it's free get my free wholesaling mind map i don't know why you wouldn't it's free if you want any of the stuff that i have that i give away a lot a lot a lot for free all you have to do is go to facebook and you just have to go to our facebook group it's under painless wholesaling group everything is featured all right guys well have a great one i don't see any other comments coming through peace out nate out <laughs>